Hello everyone. So today I encountered this uh, really interesting uh, question. This question is uh, related to customizing Jira for a specific requirement and uh, I do have an uh, uh, experience doing uh, something similar. So let me let me read uh, some of the question so, or part part of the question here. So the question is from Mohit. Mohit is uh, looking for a developer to customize uh, Jira instance and uh, what Mohit is uh, trying to do here I think uh, he is uh, using Jira or he's trying to use Jira effectively for uh, for the production schedule and uh, assigning the work and uh, the industry is printing a printing and packaging plant in Pune and uh, the reason I'm making this video is because uh, I have done something similar for printing and packaging industry in Pune and I thought I'll probably uh, make a video on this topic as well because uh, this is something where uh, where I do have do have some experience especially non-IT non-tech because usually when we do consultation we work with uh, IT companies or IT departments of, uh, uh, of, of, of 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 a big organization usually there is a there, there is an IT department everywhere I mean People who want people who want to use Jira for doing something related to usually you know service task or software de software development, but uh, you can also use Jira for uh, for other non technical uh, industries as well. And uh, if you look at uh, two of the main questions, so what Mohit is saying that uh, he is looking to create a dynamic form where the uh, where the next set of fields will be based on the user selection so if you select let us say you know country and if the country is india then the next uh, field could be something else like state or or whatever i mean it depends on what exactly you're trying to do but ba basically mohit is looking for dynamic forms and the second uh, question is about uh, reporting ability to create custom or summary reports for certain processes overdue task delay task average time taken or taken for certain issues and uh, to be honest, uh, you can do these things uh, natively in Jira as well. But if you are uh, not satisfied with the reporting in Jira, then you can always look at Easy BI. Now, going back to the previous uh, question, the first question. So, the, for, for for the second question, I think it is very obvious that uh, you you can. I mean, my my response my response is always Easy BI when it comes to reporting. I mean, of course, I'm a bit biased because uh, I'm quite comfortable using it. It really makes things a lot easier to create a report in Jira, and I think I. Uh, quite enjoy working on it but at the same time I think it is really good when it comes to using an app uh, for uh, for uh, reporting but for the dynamic form I would recommend I mean if you are doing something on server uh, and you have uh, you have a, a script now for Jira and you want to do maybe simple you want to add some dynamic nature then I would definitely recommend you to use uh, script runners uh, behavior but if you are on cloud uh, because this question is actually on cloud so I'm using uh, this example of proforma so proforma is a uh, it, it is an app that was recently I think few months back acquired by Atlassian and you can use this app to create uh, dynamic forms within Jira and not just Jira but in case you're using Jira service test you can also use uh, uh, or Jira service management, you can also create dynamic forms on your uh, Jira service management uh, portal, for example. But this would be my another recommendation. And uh, because you're saying looking for a developer to customize a Jira instance, so I would say because you have mentioned here, Mohit, that you already have a decent understanding of how Jira works, because of course it is not really a massively complicated tool, but uh, if you want to customize it further, I would say try to do it yourself because uh, if you install these apps you don't really need to like write any code or anything I mean you just need to use the app and configure it for EZBI I do have uh, like a playlist for EZBI uh, which is uh, something that you can I think you can definitely do even if you have non-technical background I think uh, if you want to learn something uh, like this you want to use Jira properly by customizing it and maybe you want to learn a couple of apps, I think you can do it yourself. But in case you're looking for a partner or a developer, I would say go to the Atlassian uh, partner portal 
where you can find partners in india um that can i mean they can probably help you they should be able to help you because that is what they do or uh, you can search in your local market or maybe just do a simple google search atlassian consultant jira consultant in india or pune um and you will definitely find people who can help you and uh, i would still say and uh, try try it yourself you can i'm sure if you have some experience doing things on jira yourself you should be able to uh use these apps but do take a look at these apps evaluate them and then see if these apps work for you or not and that is all i wanted to talk about in this video i hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new today thank you very much bye bye